So the other day I asked a question, what would you do if you knew you couldn't fail? What would you do if you knew you couldn't fail? And one of the things that I thought of for myself in answering that question was that I would push harder. If I knew I couldn't fail, I would push harder. But what would I push harder in? I'd push harder with relationships, so actually spending more time with people and building those relationships. First of all, before even going to, into how I would push harder, or what I then taught, thought to myself was, but pushing harder already reduces the risk of failure, right? So why aren't I doing it already? And I didn't have a clear answer to give myself other than, I don't know, but maybe I should actually start pushing harder in things because the more I do, the, I, the more I increase my chances of success. Many times, I think they say success is 1% talent, 99% uh, perspiration. So just being consistent, going for things, um, having grit and knowing that things will work out eventually. So I then thought, you know what? I don't know why I haven't been pushing as hard as maybe I probably could in some areas and I'm gonna start pushing. I'm gonna start working towards the things I wanna work towards, but even pushing harder. Not that I was being complacent beforehand, but now I'm going to push even further. That's what I'm thinking. What areas of my life would I push harder in? I'd push harder in relationships. I'd push harder building and maintaining them and relationships both of people within my normal circle, but also um, in building weak ties. So building relationships with people who are not within my usual circle and just learning from them and just having just richer life experiences as a result. Then I would invest more. So invest more in index funds. Now the returns on index funds may not be astronomical, but over time they've proven that even with the ups and downs of the economy, um, they still do well. So I think I would just invest more in index funds, wherever, whether they go down or up, just keep investing. After that, I'd invest in creating systems for my businesses such that I could literally give somebody a playbook and they can help me run my business. That way, um, when it comes to the, to the point of hiring, it's a lot easier to hire people to start with. And two, I can actually replace myself, make myself redundant in my business. What that then means is that my time is even more freed up to do other things that I might, might be interested in. And I also get to give other people the opportunity to try out their skills and build on their skills by working in the business. So it's a win-win. Um, but yeah, creating systems, I think is something really important and it's going to get really, really important for me as I move on to doing other things that I'm quite interested in as well. Um, but at the moment I'm lacking time for. Then my last bit was I would create, continue creating inspiring, useful, impactful, and entertaining content, um, whether it's on YouTube, whether it's via podcast or a blog, just something continue creating things that I can use to inspire people, help people live better, do better, be better, um, and generally move towards living the life that they want to live, not just going with the options that are presented, um, that seem obvious to them, but actually taking the bull by the horns and doing the things that they want to do. So yeah, that's my answer to the question, what would you do if you knew you couldn't fail? Um, I mean, I have bigger, even bigger um, dreams um, than what I've even mentioned now. Uh, but this is also just giving me extra, um, what I say, fire in my belly, as I said in my last video, to keep going and to keep pushing towards the things I want to achieve. I want to make an impact on this world, the kind of impact that by the time I go, people will know that I have been because of the level of impact that I've made. Um, I'm looking forward to touching people's lives and changing the course of many people's lineage, you know, by the things that uh, I'm able to do by God's grace. And it's going to be exciting. It's going to be exciting. I'm looking forward to making an impact on the African continent. I'm looking forward to touching people and unlocking um, talent, you know, and touching people's lives in just different ways you know I'm really I'm really looking forward to that and making a tangible tangible difference I just thought I'd share that with you tell me for you what would you do if you knew that you couldn't fail what would you do if you knew you couldn't fail all right so that was my answer to what would I do if I knew I couldn't fail
What would you do if you knew you couldn't fail? Tell me in the comments, create a video, share it with me. Let's see. And if you haven't liked or subscribed already, go ahead and do so. I'd appreciate it. And yeah, I'll catch you in the next one. Take care. Bye. So I decided to experiment with something. This video that you've just watched, I've created a video of it, a similar video in French. Well, for a few reasons. First, to help me practice my French and get more fluent in speaking, just because I think when I'm out of practice, I sound like I don't know what I like. I sound not as fluent as I know I am or can be. So I think I need to just get that practice up. Then secondly, um, I think it might just be cool to appeal to a French audience since I already speak French as well. And I think it could be quite cool uh, to get that going on YouTube. I know there are quite a lot of the well, I know of um, a few YouTubers who are actually creating content in other languages as well as their native language. If the native, native language is French or is English, rather, they would translate it to Spanish and other or other ones. I know Mr. Beast um, does this. So I'm looking to try it out and see see what happens with that. Um, like I said, it's going to help me with you know, just being more fluent in French, uh, being able to think on the spot and speak, you know. Uh, so yeah, I'm looking forward to it. Check it out if you want to. Um, I'll put a link to that video in the description. And going forward, where I can, I'll create uh, French versions of the video as well. It might take me a bit longer to do. It might um, not be as detailed as maybe I might be if I said the same thing in English. But I think overall it's, it's going to be good and obviously if anybody wants to check out who checks out the French wants to check out the English version I'll put a link as well and they can check it out but yeah I just thought I'd try that out so help me out click the link subscribe to that channel because I'm going to be putting it on a separate channel just so that um, I can keep things separate but yeah I think it's going to be pretty cool uh, let me know what you think all right I'll catch you in the next one take care bye and don't forget to like and subscribe please this channel and the other channel too thank you bye